everybody, I'm Bethel. And I'm Grace. And we're with Green Eyed Grace. And today we're making a simple DIY lavender body butter. So to make this body butter, you're going to need 1 4th cup shea butter, 1 half cup grapeseed oil, 1 4th cup almond oil, 1 tablespoon rosehip seed oil, 2 tablespoons beeswax, 1 4th teaspoon xanthan gum, and 1 teaspoon vitamin E. It is okay to substitute the grapeseed and almond oil if you can't use those or if you don't have them. So Gracie is actually standing on a stool right now. She's not this tall. But Gracie, tell us a little bit about why lavender is great for the skin well, and the body. Well, it's very calming and it makes you feel super calm. And you can actually put it on your pillow to make you, to make you sleep better. It's very nice. And it heals your wounds if you have any scratches or anything. Yeah. Yeah, and burns. Yeah, and a lot of the time burns. And it's just really calming for the skin. Yeah, and it's also good for sensitive skin. So anybody can use it, right? Yeah, yeah. definitely. So we're gonna kind of walk through how to make the body butter. And once you're done, you don't really have to let it cool. It's a lot easier than doing a whipped body butter because you can just pour it into your glass container and let it cool. Um, and the eight ounce containers are about this big. And then a six ounce, this is actually a six ounce jar, um, a mason jar. So you can totally use mason jars or anything you can find that's glass. If you pour it into plastic, often it will melt because it's kind of warm when it comes off the stove. So, just something to note. But it does make about, um, makes like three, four ounce containers. So it's gonna fill both of these, probably almost full. So let's get started. So right now I am stirring in this xanthan gum. And don't forget you need to add this in for the last part. So, but once you have that all stirred in, you need 10 drops of this lavender oil. Essential oil. Lavender essential oil. <laughs> and seven drops of this, it's called Ling Ling. Yeah, it looks like Elang Elang, but it's actually yeah. pronounced Ling Ling, I've been told, and I'm not sure why. Because <laughs> <laughs> it has like Y and Ling. Yeah, it is weird. So for the recipe, you can buy the book. There are a lot of recipes in this book that are on the website, the greeneyedgrace.com website. Um, but if you don't wanna to have to buy a book, it is also on the blog for free. So, yeah. By the way, hey, if you wanna check this out, this book is called Beyond Beauty. It has a lot of recipes in it that I, I think you'll like. Oil and perfume make the heart glad and the sweetness of a friend comes from his earnest counsel. Proverbs 27, 9. <laughs> but she's going to tell us a little bit about um, why lavender is beneficial for the skin. Well, it's very calming and actually if you put it on your pillow, it may help you sleep better and you can really heal your wounds if you have have any cats with cuts. <laughs> no, what? <laughs> you said cats. Cats with scratches. Cut. 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 So if you want to download the recipe, it is on the blog for free. Um, but if you want the book, it is also on the website. And that has, this has the... <laughs> Can you tell us a little bit about why lavender is great for the skin? Well, it's very calming and it makes you feel really calming. So, you already said that. <laughs> I could say it. Buddy, <laughs> we are trying to. Oh, I didn't realize. So, if you want to buy the book, it also has the recipes, bunches of recipes, and bunches of bunches. <laughs> <laughs> That's just never going to get done with this video. <laughs> Thanks for watching.